Hey guys, Assalamu alaikum. Welcome to my channel. Now, today is a hot topic that I found on OMG Ubuntu. That is Ubuntu, Fedora, and OpenSUSE are coming to the Windows Store. Now, what is said, Ubuntu will soon be available to install from the Windows Store on Windows 10. And as he was writing, that nope, I'm not drunk and you're not hallucinating. The news was announced by Microsoft's Terry Myers at the Software Giants annual build conference for developers. What's more, Ubuntu isn't the only Linux distribution plant. Microsoft says it is working with SUSE and Fedora to bring their Linux distros to the Windows Store atop the Windows subsystem for Linux. Developers will be able to download these Linux distros from the Windows Store on Windows 10 from the Atom and will be able to run multiple distributions at the same time. Anyway, Microsoft say that WSL was always designed to be distro agnostic and this is the first time we are exercising this aspect of the system and invite developers to try things out and report issues on their github page and it is also important to remember that while you you will be able to install ubuntu fedora and OpenSUSE from the windows store you won't be installing a linux distro with a gui or graphical user interface desktop environment display server and a suite of x11 apps But what you do get is a full Ubuntu Vero OpenSUSE user space and development environment on Windows without the overhead of virtualization or emulation running in parallel with your Windows Y tools. And that's nothing, no small feat of engineering. Yeah, there will be so much bugs and all. It's not gonna be, you know, ready like in in a flick in, in uh, sh like two days, three days. No, it's, it's a massive work. But I really don't like it. Do you? I'm sure you'll also not like it. You know, because there's so many issues, especially privacy issues in Windows 10. Now, here, here is the snapshot of how it's gonna be on Windows uh, 10 store. As you can see, there's Ubuntu Canonical Group Limited. And there's a description and all. There's some screenshots. So what I understand is you will have command line uh, bash enable uh, command line so you'll be able to work uh, you know uh, some specific coding or you know connecting to your server which is yes best on Linux but that's already uh, it will not be the same as you can see on my screen with my system Ubuntu so it's it, it, it has you know yeah kernel it has uh, graphics drivers and, and other stuff so it's it's only for developer or focused on developers so I wonder how it's gonna be hmm let's wait and see thanks for watching and see you later